Hey everybody, it's Gregatron. Uh, there's this disturbing topic that I came across on Yahoo. This article was put up about four days ago, <clears throat> so I'm a little late on it. Basically, there's this kid who was being bullied by his own teacher. And it wasn't just any kid, uh, you know, kid. And he was 10 years old. Uh, it was in New Jersey at... Horseman Elementary. I'll, I'll leave all that in the box. But basically, there's this kid, Akian. Uh, he was having some trouble in school. Uh, he was throwing chairs in class and kind of acting up. He was acting a little different. <clears throat> but Dad was shocked because he's never been violent. He's never had any trouble like that. So they send in a what was it, uh, a behaviorist, behavioralist, they sent one of those people in, and there was really nothing wrong with him, he was doing fine, and, uh, the teacher, I guess, was pushing him to, to, you know, act up, but he was fine, there was nothing wrong with him, so it's still a mystery at that point, and the dad, gets to the point where he's so curious he figures why not just record it so I when I when I read that he recorded it, I thought he you know put a hidden camera in the class but no he put a wire he put a wire on this kid on a key and to find all these horrible nasty things from the teacher and the teacher aide some pretty terrible stuff some pretty disgusting things uh, they were just inappropriate in general. Just terrible, man. I remember, I watched the video as well. Uh, there's a video up. But, uh, yeah, they were talking about their husbands and how they don't like their life at home and all this BS and talking about their drinking habits and just all this nonsense, just crazy stuff had nothing to do with school nothing to do with class nothing to do with work just at home stuff stuff that you keep to yourself stuff that, that you say to your buddies at the bar basically they were saying in a classroom of 10 year olds class of little kids and they're <clears throat> they're acting like it's a, a social event these these people weren't professional at all uh Anyway, uh, then they were talking about, they were calling the kids names. Uh, like when a kid would ask a question, they would say no and they'd be mean about it and jackasses, just terrible things, man. You, I'm not really going to tell the whole story, but I mean, they called him a bastard. How, how do you do that? How do you call a kid, first of all, he, he's a little boy. And second of all, he's autistic. How can you call a little boy a, a bastard for asking a question? These I can't even call these, these people women because I have no respect for people like that. That's what I call a bitch. They're bitches. And the dad was such a humble person. I watched him in his video. The, the dad didn't call him any bad names but man if that was me man i, I would have slapped somebody man uh the lady didn't even get fired or the aide which is ridiculous they're still teaching i don't know if she's still at that school but she still works there that's that's awful uh calling the kid bastard talking about drugs Talking about your husband, nobody gave a shit. Just being unprofessional. Uh, and, and they still let it slide. Uh, something's got to stop. Something ain't right, because, well, we know that. But that's, that's beyond the line. Uh, of course, the dad wants justice, and so does everybody else. <clears throat> It hurts me as a person, because I have two godbrothers, they're autistic, and they're grown men. 
if somebody makes fun of them, it pisses me off when they're grown men. So how can you piss off a little kid? A little kid, let alone an autistic kid. Uh, so I'm kind of running on now with this. Uh, that's just 